Hello, winners! Welcome back to our channel. I'm Michelle. I'm Natalie. And she's taller than me. <coughs> Look at this. What the heck, you guys? Sorry, I'm like really noticing it because I mean I notice it when she's standing next to me because I kind of have to look just slightly up now. But we at the beginning of our video, well not the beginning, sorry, um, the thumbnail. We were taking it, you know, we take a little picture for the thumbnail, and I'm looking. I'm like, she's taller than me in the picture now, because we're standing. Because normally we're sitting. When we're sitting, we're kind of we're a little bit closer to the same size, but I think it's a little bit more obvious when she's standing. <laughs> Anyways, did we even introduce ourselves or did I get distracted? I got distracted. Hi, I'm Michelle. I'm Natalie. And, um, to my 11 year old kid, she's taller than me and it's, it's distracting me today. Um, but we've got more lunch flies to review with you guys today. Um, I'm in theme for it. Yes, I match one of the backpacks, I'm in theme for the other two. Um, this is my Ant-Man dress from Happiness Collection, if you guys know by now, they're one of my favorite small shops that does skater dresses, so make sure to check them out. I've got a discount code for them in the bottom corner here. Um, the current code here with the sm smiles happy- no. I forgot what the code is. <laughs> It's got the number 20 in it. Um, that's the current like summer special discount right now for 20% off. The normal discount that we um, are able to give you guys is 15, but the summer months are a little bit slower. So we were running a little bit of a session of 20%. So currently it should be 20. Um, if you're watching this at a later date, just change the number 20 to 15 and it'll still work. It should give you 15% off. Um, and I'm wearing my school uniform. Although all you see is oversized sweater. You can kind of see the polo she's got underneath. But anyways, so for today's video, it is themed, but at the same time, all newer bags that are still available in case um, you guys haven't seen these yet or um, whatever reasoning or you haven't seen it. Because our last video, I was kind of going back and forth about how um, I think we do like doing themed videos for anyone that would like to look for, you know, a bunch of bags of a specific character or movie, but then we also like to show you guys what's new so that they're, you know, these are bags that you can still easily get if you like them. Because obviously a lot of my older bags, when we do the themed ones, they're not available anymore. And um, yeah, just we're, you know, we want to review both kind of cool old ones to show you guys like what's come out before but also we like to show you guys the new stuff that way you get a better look at the new details and everything like that and if maybe it'll sway you one way or the other towards getting a bag but anyways three bags today um two are exclusive to like different places the third one is should be available at pretty much all the small shops and even box lunch so it's a lot easier to get would you like to pick one and show it? I know you won't know the character, but... Here's the first one. Alright, this is the one I'm dressed as. Ant-Man. Yeah, yeah, look at this. Ah, uh, yeah, so cute. The red's like a little bit different, but you've got his like utility belt and stuff. But yeah, so this is Ant-Man. You want to go ahead and show the details and I'll let them know a little bit about it. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry. If you hold it really close to it, I think it'll focus on the bag more than us, so you can just pan up slowly. It's- I'm tr we're trying to figure out how to get the cinematic mode to work because I think that it shows the details a little bit better when we do like close-up details. But this is an Amazon exclusive, so you should- and it's- yeah, it, it was an Amazon exclusive. I had pre-ordered it and when it came out it shipped right away. Um, if you don't know, we were waiting for an Ant-Man bag for a really long time because I think there was like a pin set that included an Ant-Man bag, but no bag had released while the other pins in the collection had, you know, a bag counterpart in real life. Ant-Man was the only one that didn't. We were like, you're teasing that there's going to be an Ant-Man bag, we just haven't seen it yet. But Amazon was the one that finally ended up um, being the one that stocked it. So you can see his helmet at the top there with his goggles and stuff, the little um, kind of nose mouthpiece right there on the front, more detailing of his helmet. So this is a vinyl. This is all, you know, the normal faux leather, pleather feeling 
material. The front area right here is textured. You want to show them that close up? So the red part of his uniform right there on that front pocket is like this cool texture um, of his uniform. That's all this perfectly. Hmm? That's all this perfectly. You do what? It, it focused perfectly. Oh good, yeah. So again, so all the little bits there, you know, different detailings and appliques to make it look like the front of his suit. So I think this, they did a very good job with all the detailing on this. Of course, you've got the, I think Infinity Saga plaque right on there, is that what that is? Is this Infinity Saga? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I think all of the bags that were released in like this previous, you know, Marvel universe you know because they're kind of onto a new one right now right um i think infinity saga is everything pre um oh my gosh i forgot the name of the movie the final avengers movie i just had a brain fart you guys know which one i'm talking about i'm just i'm having a brain fart right now i'm i've been i'm running on like two hours of sleep a night so i am out of it anyways um, Infinity Saga is pretty much like all the bags and characters movies that are that came out in this you know the first Marvel Universe series but you've got two side pockets there on the side they're fairly plain they're like silver the side pockets you know they're just silver with um, striping on there same with the other side um, I think there's an MSO on the back yeah, yeah. you've got his silhouette there um, debossed on the back in red, well, the rest of the bag is black. So you might be able to see it in the camera right now, but you see that like shiny material? Yeah. It's like super shiny, huh? <laughs> it's not vinyl or anything. It's still the faux leather, but it's like a, it's the shiny version of leather, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, go ahead and show them the inside here. So fairly simple, red background with Ant-Man printed all over there. Should put a bunch of ants in there, that'll really cute. <laughs> and then there's a back of the But yeah, super cute for all you Ant-Man fans like me where we've been waiting for this bag like forever, you know. I've been waiting to get Ant-Man because they have most of the other <coughs> Marvel characters, like again, I want these previous um the infinity saga i think this was the only one that was no you know hulk came out oh hulk is on um amazon too for anyone that doesn't know that yet it's it does have his face on the top portion of it i haven't decided how i feel about it just yet if i do want a hulk bag we'll see if it goes on a sale for really cheap i might still grab it even if i'm like not super into the face but if it's on sale for a great price i'll still probably grab it some of the Amazon bags, when they go on sale, they go down to like $40, $30. So for that price, I do like it enough to pay $30 for it. I'm just, I don't think I like it enough to pay full price. If that makes sense. Um, but yeah, Ant-Man, super cool. So if you're a big fan, make sure to grab that from Amazon. Uh, next I'm one. Guess it. Oh, you want to guess? Okay. Which character do you think this is? What does it kind of look like? Because you might... You might think this looks like a different character than what it is. I thought it was Star Lord for a sec. <laughs> Not Star Lord. I thought it was until I saw the hammer. Which character carries a hammer? Thor. Thor. So this is uh, Mighty Thor. So this is Jane Foster. This is a girl. She was um she took over the power of Thor in um the newest Thor movie. Which again, brain fart, I can't remember. Love and Thunder, good god, I'm not, I cannot remember names today. I am, like I said, I am so tired. I'm, yeah, I've been getting like two, three at best hours each night for the past, like at least the past like week. It's gotta be longer than that by this point. I'm running on adrenaline. Um, but this one is a pink a la mode exclusive. This one did get delayed quite a bit, so, um, but it finally came in. She's so pretty. I think there actually is one other version of Jane. I feel like there's one more and I'm having a brain fart again. Sorry. Get my get myself together, but I'll try to look it up, put it on the side for you if there is a second version. I'm almost positive there is a second version of her. 
but this version is from like I said Pink on the Mode it's an exclusive to them I want to say it is still available but fairly cool Natalie's right she probably recognized it from like the helmet too because it is kind of similar ish to what Thor would have um but yeah you've got her whole head here there's an applique just all like a ton of different applique to make up her helmet so you get like a lot, a lot of nice detailing there on the helmet same with the breastplate on the front pocket focus oh my goodness there we go got all of that it's just different appliques stitching and stuff so it's not just like a flat printed on but there is you know they they made an effort to like get you that 3d feel by putting an applique and stuff on it like a really nice new plaque of thor love and thunder on there to mark the movie it came from you do get a little zipper pull of Yolnir. oh my gosh it's this focus is gonna kill me there we go nice and shiny. I don't think there's a special zipper pull on that one, right? Yeah, no, there's not. I just have a little Funko Pop <coughs> keychain hanging on there. Yeah. <coughs> nice front design there with an over-the-top front pocket. You get two side pockets with more of her design on the side. Just more nice detailing on the back here. So this pattern here is just all printed on while the back here is debossed so you get like fancy here in the back with the debossing pattern um the main overall part of the bag here so this it's that nice like old school material that lounge fly sorry I'm gonna, sorry babe i'm gonna have to block your face a little bit so that it focuses on the back there we go so you guys can kind of see it that's cr that cross hat that cross hatching so the bags, I feel like the bags that have this nice stiff material that has that crotch hatching pattern on there is usually, it feels a lot more sturdy. You know what I mean? Like, this material. So a lot of my older bags are made from this material. It's like the newer ones tend to be like the softer polyurethane material that feels like it won't hold up as well. Um, most of mine have been okay, but yeah like this 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 material right here i would love if more bags came in this material because it feels nice and sturdy and it can withstand a little bit more i think at least the one the bags that i've had that it's made of that material they're they're pretty sturdy inside okay. so it's gonna be a little hard to see But it is Mighty Thor in different poses with the Thor Love and Thunder logo as well. As well as, you see the little logo on here on there? So it's like black on this deep red, so it's like really hard to see like through the camera, I think. In person, it's a little bit easier to see. Just <coughs> So there's a back zipper pocket. I don't know if I mentioned to you guys the reason why we're standing for these more recent videos is because one, I'm running out of space on my floor. Don't judge me. I need to figure out a new storage situation. I think I need one more of these shelves and put it there. I originally did it because of the window right there, but at this point I'm so out of space that I think I'm gonna have to change it. The only problem is these shelves are usually really expensive. The two I have now, I bought when they were on sale for I think a really good price, but now it's like $400 for one of these shelves and I can't, I can't justify $400 for the shelf. So, um, I have to wait until it goes on sale and figure out something else and, but yes, the bags, there's kind of everywhere so that's what partly why we're standing and the second part is like it kind of hurts our legs after sitting on the ground for a while so we figured maybe try standing in a few videos and see how we feel about it but all right on to the last bag for today you might like this one baby if you want to put in the light do you see what color it is it's not just black it's hollow yeah it's pretty that's pretty huh i know i know my kid but i knew that she would think the hollow was pretty so this is the newest Black Panther bag. It's part of the um, Marvel Metallic series. Um, 
this one is available at like all the small shops as well as box lunch even so i was able to use box lunch money on this one which was awesome um i've noticed that box lunch is starting to stop a lot of lounge flies that are like the the core you know the core catalog that's been that's been releasing at the small shops um box lunch used to carry more of just kind of like their bags but I've been noticing that now they're stocking a lot of like these these catalog bags. So if you're able to wait or you know try to use some discount codes on them, Box Lunch is a great option for you to save some money if you have like coupons to use because um, for now you're able to use coupons on Lunchflies. Uh, but yeah, so if you didn't know, the Lunchfly is doing like a whole series on Marvel Metallics. So I have a few. I ordered Captain America from a small shop that I still haven't gotten. I don't know what's going on. Um, they just, they they haven't received it from Loungefly and so they haven't been able to send it to us. I'm, I see other small shops have gotten it though, so I don't know what's going on with this one. So hopefully I eventually get it. I'm also waiting on a card holder from them too, the, one of the Jurassic Park ones there. I don't know what happened. So I'm waiting for that one to come in. Um, Daddy bought me Iron Man. Oh no, sorry. Wait for it. Iron Man is not part of this metallic thing. The metallic Iron Man, like the newest Iron Man metallic one with like the matching crossbody and stuff, that's actually its own thing. That's like the 15th anniversary of Iron Man. I believe it's 15. This has been a lot of numbers, so I'm trying to keep track of like the different numbers, but it's, I think it's 15. Cause yeah, 2008 was like my senior year in high school. Yeah, so it's around there. Um, Iron Man is not part of the Metallic series. I think a lot of people get confused because it like it was like the first Metallic Marvel one that came out right before the series came out. So people keep thinking it's part of it, but it's actually an anniversary series by itself. I think Iron Man, oh no, sorry, Captain America was like the first of the Marvel Metallic series. There's like Captain America, there's Loki, Black Panther, Spider-Man. I want the Spider-Man one. Um, I think that's it so far. I can't remember. Thanos, I think, was the next one. There's probably, I think there's one more and I'm just, I can't think of it right now. I'm like looking at my other bags because I'm like, if I see one of them, maybe I'll remember. I cannot remember, but there is a handful of them um, out. This is one of the latest ones. I was able to grab it from Boston. So like I said, this one's pretty cool. This one's got like the iridescent going on there that Natalie showed you guys. So you want to show the, 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 the it's so nice. Do you see it? Mm-hmm. So like that, you got like the iridescent, hollow, not iridescent, it's like holographic because it's rainbow. Iridescent is just when it's like color shifting, but when it's like the rainbow one is holographic, right? I think that's like the difference. Mm -hmm. but, show you guys this way now I can kind of see it too but you got the holographic color on black there a lot of stitching different alec applique pieces to give you some great detailing of his outfit so of course you have his necklace there at the top got the front pocket marble plaid you get two side pockets with more of um that like claw detail I think that's what it's supposed to be Let's go all the way around. We've got his logo. Got the Black Panther logo on the back. This is a good thing that they've changed out too. I know we, we know how this material is, right? Like it cracks and stuff on the straps. They did switch it up. The strap is a faux, that faux leather material of the backpack. So it is a glittery though, you can see it bottom is made of the same thing too so i think i mentioned it in my last video where when the bag is this material i'm, I'm glad that now they're starting to put like a sturdier material for the bottom because this i feel like would scratch up pretty quickly so you're already having to be careful with that i don't want to have to be careful with the bottom of it too and get it all scratched up but strap bottom is made of that material <laughs> Inside's pretty simple too. It's just black with them. There we go. 
the Avengers logo and Black Panther logo, just repeating. And a pretty simple black one. Yes, that's an open back pocket. Okay. Does this look bigger to you? <laughs> Does this look bigger to you? Let me go back. Let me go back. I can try to prepare some. Just grab the ammo one right here. What do you think? Just a tiny bit? You're about like an inch or so. I'd say it's a tiny bit taller. I'm like, sorry, I'm trying it's to line up the bottom. Yeah, I think I think it is taller, but just like just taller. Not enough that you'd really probably make it like you wouldn't say like, oh yeah, this one's gonna fit like a lot more like a mid-size. It's just a little bit bigger than the normal mini. Yeah. Like I said, this one should be available at pretty much all small shops, unless they've sold out, but that would mean, you know, just there's chances are there will be another small shop that has it, or I think, like I said, I think even Box Lunch is still in stock too. So if that's one you'd like, there's that. But, all right, that's the three for today. What should we have an answer for a question? I'm not good at these prompts. Well, it depends on what, sometimes like something will like strike at me, but this one not quite yet. I think nothing really stood out to me right now. What's your favorite Marvel movie? It's been a while since we probably asked that. Let us know your favorite Marvel movie. Or, um, or you know what? Let us know what you're excited about, like, that's coming out soon. Because there is quite a few things coming out soon. I want to say the new Loki series comes out pretty soon. Right? Which one are you excited for? Ugh, good question. Too tired to think. I'm excited for Loki. I'm excited for the new Deadpool because you saw the Wolverines coming back. Um, I'm sure there's something I'm forgetting that's coming out. Like I said, I am just, I'm really tired and I can't quite think straight. But yeah, let us know what your favorite one is or let us know what you're looking forward to in terms of uh, Marvel. Yeah, what do you think you do? Like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you're notified when we post another video. And don't forget to follow all the fun social media pages. I link them all down below. If you guys haven't followed them, make sure you do. Um, you know, we're gonna try to grow this channel on YouTube. I'm gonna try to grow my other social medias a little bit too. So if you haven't followed my TikTok, pop over to my TikTok because I still haven't figured out the the trick to the algorithm to try to get my videos to do well on there. I've got one real one video that did fairly well recently and now, and now i'm like trying to figure out how to get the other videos <laughs> but anyways yeah follow the social medias um and yeah all right you guys thank you so much for watching we will see y'all next time bye